Hello my people, it is your Brennick from Texas Nate and we are doing another media review. Today is on the UHD Club uh, version of Apollo 13. This is their version B, version B. Of course I got this from the good folks at the Media Psycho, so go check them out at the link down below, uh, UC21. And it, this is kind of raised. As you can see here, some glossing on it as well. So it's kind of cool. I love stuff like this. This is the 4K Universal set. Okay. And this is the lenticular. I like this one because it's different. Houston, we have a problem. And yes, probably people are like, why do you have this thing here? Yeah, that's the sticker. It's on the outside. I always put them on mine. That's just what I do. All right, let's go on and open this bad boy up. All right. We're losing stuff, and it hasn't even started the review yet. Come on. All right, well, since you want to come out, this, of course, is the bottom. They give you one like this. So. All right, so that's what you got on the inside. The landing. There you got. All right, we got to pull out here. So that'll pull out the, the actual piece. Oh yeah, and that works flawlessly, which is what I like. Before we get to that though, we're gonna take a look at what's inside. So we got the coin that comes from there. Okay, we're gonna take a look. So you got the design. Get the moon. Okay. Launched April 11th, 1970. Returned 19th, April 17th, 1970. Okay. And the way they do it is these cards don't come in the box. They come separately and you can just put them in there. That's what I do after... And mine is number 57 out of 100. Okay. Go on, put that back in there. That way it doesn't get lost. Because when you have chilling like I have, things decide to get lost after a while. Okay. All right. Let's pull that to the side. Let's go and take a look at this. We've actually got a outer container. So it's got Tom Hanks on it. And it's a wraparound. And so it's just a slip cover. Of what's in here. Okay. So we've got, that's the front, spine, and then we got a helmet with some spot glossing on it. And it's magnetic, so it makes it even better. We got the Tom Hanks. And then you have the 4K and the Blu-ray. Let's see, is there anything behind it? Just the stars. And let's try this one too. My best stars. No. You got, a, you got a big one. So yeah, not too bad. Like I said, it's magnetic. So it holds tight, which is good. Okay, we got a book. Of course, I always enjoy books. So this one is, of course, from... These are pictures from the movie. Um, we don't have any writing, per se, other than just Apollo 13. There you go. There's Houston. Gary Sinise. I mean, they just don't make movies like this anymore. Kevin Bacon. And come on. Bill Paxton. You know. And I always enjoy these kind. Because it's just good images. And they, they took good ones. Yep. We've lost communication. Where are you at, Apollo? Where are you at? All right. Let 
the, uh, the big drawing at the end. Love it. All right, and then we got another box here. Of course, we've got the other goodie box that we have. Same thing. So, so we have a lot. There's a lot in here, folks. So we have some posters. And then we have some cards. So we're going to go and do the posters first. Okay. Don't they know how to do it? The bacon. The baconator. Of course, the classic. Everybody knows. Houston, we have a problem. And then, there's one more. Ha oh. ha. Failure is not an option. That's right, it's not an option. Do not, do not take failure. All right. Now we got the cars. Now we have a, there's some duplicates too. So, so we'll just go through these real fast. They actually have a backing to it. It's all the same one, but at least there's, it's not just blank. There we go. Going to the shuttle. The probe. Our boys in action. There he is. Just wish this would have been a little brighter so you could have seen his face a little bit better. But yeah, but it's freezing in there. Yeah. They like the trio picks. There's Sinise. Hanks. There he is. Ground control. Ground control to Major Tone. All right, Hanks. And this is like I was saying, we got a couple of doubles here. We got the trio. But no Sinise, this is Bacon. And then we've got the landing. And that's it. All right, folks. Let's get to the table. Let's talk about this movie. All right. All right, folks. We just got done taking a look at this. Um, this is a phenomenal set. Thank you, UHD Club. And, of course, thank, thank you, Media Cyclops, for making this possible. And so, what are my thoughts on set? Well, I don't have Apollo 13. This is the only one I have in. This is set. There was the Steelbook. There was a 4K. There was the 20th anniversary Blu-ray a long time ago. What this does, it combines all of those into one box set. So you get the 4K, you get the 20th anniversary Blu-ray. So all the special features are here in one box set. Um, so you can get this one or you get the Steelbook because the Steelbook had both as well. But I would recommend this because you get the cards, you get the book, you get the setup, the coin. Oh my goodness, that coin is phenomenal. Um, and it's a premium edition. And that's what you got to ask yourself. Do you want the premium? Do you want just the steelbook or do you want just the 4K? You got to play with your wallet. Your wallet is what t dictates to you what you need to do. But mine says, I want the special edition, so I'm going with it. So do I recommend this? Hell yes, I do. Go get this. I mean, we got DTS, you know, there's 5.1. We have, now, there's not Dolby Atmos because they didn't do it. It was just DTSX. So you ain't going to have that. But you do have HDR10, you know, for the 4K. And then 1080, of course, for the Blu-ray. So you get everything that was already there before in one package. And so to me, that's well worth it. All right, folks, been your redneck from Texas name. It's been our review of the UHD Club 21 Apollo 13, courtesy of Media Psychos. Thank you, guys, and have a good one, and I'll see you in the next one. All right, all right, all right.